This is the Dwarf 3, and I'm going to use it to take a picture. This is my first time using this telescope, so wish me luck. We're here at Stargaze Nova Scotia. We've got dark skies, and I've set the telescope up here on the stargazing plateau with a clear view of the entire Milky Way. The telescope did not come with a tripod, so I went and purchased this ball head mount tripod from Amazon. Okay, I'm going to try to take this first image in EQ mode. That's where we tilt the telescope to match our latitude. To use EQ mode, we're going to use the telescope's built-in polar alignment feature. It's a little counterintuitive because it's the back of the telescope that points north. That looks about right. We'll go right to Atlas and choose a target. Let's go to, look at that, the North America Nebula and Deadpool fit in the same field of view. And then it goes and moves. What are you doing? It's pointing at the ground. It's pointing at the sky. I think, I think this telescope is smarter than me. Okay, calibration is successful. Do I have to hit go? What happens if I hit go? Initializing. There's no matching dark frame for your current settings. Add an ND filter. ND filter, I wonder if that's just the filter. I guess we'll take our solar filters out and these should clip on magnetically. It shows us rolling the shutter down. I click the shooting button on the right to start capturing dark frames. Five minutes, okay. Let's come back in five minutes. Five minutes later. Now that we've done taking our darks, I'm gonna pop off the solar filter here, and we're gonna say, yes, we're back to point it at the sky. Oh, but look, we've got our first exposure, and we can almost see the nebula. That's Deadpool's eyes in the Deadpool Nebula. We've just got America and Mexico here in North America. We cut out Canada. Processing, processing. Well, we should let this run for a while. We'll come back in a little bit and see what it looks like. One hour later. All right, so I let this run for a while, but the clouds are starting to come in. The image is looking pretty darn good though. And we'll try again another night, check back. In a future video, we'll get some better images for sure. I'm John Reed, this is Learn to Stargaze. Subscribe to take your stargazing to the next level. And remember, the future is looking up.